11 days since the closure of the sea to fishing activities. This is to afford juvenile fishes time to grow and matured fishes to spawn during the period. Some fishermen at Jamestown say they are reeling under the harsh effects that the closed fishing season presents. The one-month sea closure seems to have exposed some of the fishermen to hunger. The impact also extends to the shore laborers and fish processors. This, they say, has paved way for social vices to thrive in the area. The closure of the sea has really disturbed us. Some fishermen have now turned to thieves and stealing from people. Just this dawn, cell phones belonging to five individuals have been stolen. If fishing is in season, the fishermen will not have appetite for stealing. But the closed fishing season is not being adhered to by some of the fishermen. Meet 35-year-old Kojo Ejumaku, a fisherman and the father of nine children. He confessed defying the order. I secretly went for fishing at dawn because I was hungry. I shouldn't have gone, but I could not bear hunger anymore. The fishermen recommended stringent monitoring regime for industrial trawlers when the fishing season resumes. This amateur video obtained from the fishermen show how industrial trawlers over harvest juvenile fish and later dump them into the ocean after they had died. <laughs> Meanwhile, some fish processors have taken opportunity of the closed fishing season to increase the price of their fish. This woman is a canoe owner and also a financier of operations of some canoes at the Jamestown Landing Beach. She hoarded stock during the fishing season and now sells at high price. She and her colleague justify the price increase. It is evident that prices of fish have soared. Previously, a cutting of fish sells between 1,500 and 2,000 cities. But now, a cutting costs 2,500 cities. The fish, oil, and fuel wood all shot up. This has influenced the price hike of fried fish. The closed fishing season will be observed by artisanal fishermen for a month, while industrial trawlers will observe it for two months. Stanley Nibleu, TV3 News, Jamestown Landing Beach, Accra.